Hey, uh, excuse me. What? For a hundred dollars, would you throw this cake? Come on, man. It's re for a hundred bucks. I just throw yeah. it. Yeah. All right. So, well, hold on. All right. Yeah, it's legit. All right, hold on. Hmm. You have another cake for a hundred dollars, Benton? Nah, that's that's the only cake I had. All right. Thank you. Hey, uh, excuse me. What's up? If I give you a hundred dollars, would you throw this cake? A hundred bucks? Yeah. No. That's that's messed up. You shouldn't do that. Like, why would you waste a perfectly good cake? Well, I mean, it's also a hundred dollars. It's a perfectly good cake. It's not worth a hundred bucks. I mean, anyone could. That's perfectly good cake. Why would you waste food? Like, you should, how were you raised? Like, <laughs> it's my dad's birthday, bro, and you're gonna waste a, you're gonna waste a perfectly good cake right in front of me. Like, that's messed up, honestly. Like, well, how about this? What, what if I gave you the cake since it's your dad's birthday? You sure? Yeah. I mean, I mean, thank you. I mean. <laughs> um, so it's your dad's birthday today. Yeah, I mean, I don't know how I'm going to carry this on the bus. I mean. Oh, well, what are you doing out here, like, in the in the rain? <sighs> uh, it's a long story. Um, oh, well, I mean, I got time if you want to talk. Sure. I'm, I'm done. All right, well, look, at least it's starting to drizzle again, but there's a little place where we can, like, you know, hang out and, and talk, cool. if that's cool with you. I mean, I'm done. All right, cool. Yeah. Then follow me. Yeah. All right, well, thank God that we made it on time. Yeah. I mean, it's it's starting to pour really bad, but here, yeah. you can use it as a cover, yeah. So uh, talk to me a little bit more about, like, your, your dad and stuff. I mean... I <laughs> He means a lot to me. Yeah, he means the world to me. I really appreciate what he does for me and my family. Um, uh, we struggle. We go by paycheck by paycheck. I mean, he works out of state and uh, we hardly see him. Uh, every uh, every other month like, he comes and visits and it just happens to be his birthday. And I just thought that it just sucked how he hard work for our family and like I can we barely can do so little for him and I just wanted to do something special for him and uh, I was just really looking forward to seeing him tonight got you yeah no well I mean you know happy birthday to your dad and stuff and um, yeah I, I noticed that you were like walking in the rain um, why is that <laughs> it's so stupid I mean it's my idiot self lent my vehicle, my truck, my only source of transportation really um, to my cousin, which is a distant uh, relative. Uh, he had some trouble uh, still with his vehicle and he needed to borrow my uh, my truck. And I thought like, why not? It's the blood's blood. Uh, family is like so important to me and our family and just thought like, sure, just uh, bring it back to me still once you're done. And I, um, Silly me, I trusted him. Turns out like he was doing some bad stuff and I don't know, I just one thing led to another, there was some crash or something, I'm not sure. I just, uh, all I know is I got a call from the insurance company and uh, it's, it just. Yeah, that your car was like basically totaled. Yeah. Man, that sucks. And I feel you, I mean, I've been in situations like that too where, it's you know. It's crazy, like why? Like, yeah. I've lent a couple of cars to my friends and, you know, they've totaled it as well. Yeah. And then getting that phone call from the insurance saying that, hey, you know, your car is basically totaled and you're like, wait, what? Why? <laughs> no, it's crazy because, like, it's my, it was also my only, like, source of income. I mean, oh, I, okay. I did Uber. Oh, yeah, I did. I did Uber. Um, I just started a couple of months ago and I was doing really good and it just sucks, right? Like. I needed it and like now I just Mhm. Mm are you like in college or like you know are you are you working? Well, I'm currently a freshman in college. Oh, okay. I, I just started and um well now I'm going to be having to take the bus. I mean it's pretty far from here. I mean it's going to suck, honestly. Um what my cousin did just Yeah. I should take it back, honestly. Well, I mean 
life sucks honestly like sometimes you know you feel like you can trust someone and then suddenly you know boom your vehicle's totaled it's a really nice cake by the way yeah no it's it's all yours i mean like are you into cars as well my dad is He's oh your dad is cars. okay um what's like his favorite like all-time vehicle <laughs> He's a Ford guy. I mean, oh okay. He's just all into the newest model and stuff. It's just it's, uh, he knows everything about vehicles, all, all about the Fords, and he just keeps up with it. I just, I just, uh, I don't really see. Uh, I'm not really interested in vehicles as much as he is. I mean, I just see it as a uh, form of transportation. Um, but yeah, I just feel like. I wish I could do something like special for him, you know. Mm-hmm. Uh, it'd be nice just to, to give it back to. Like, and uh, what type of car was it that your, you know, that your cousin basically totaled? <laughs> it was an old timey like M4. Um, oh okay. It was like really old, like 2001, I think. Uh, I mean, it, it did the it did it, it, did, it did the job. job yeah, it did the job. I mean, I'm not I'm not gonna complain. Um, but yeah, I mean, it is what it is. Man, that honestly, it sucks, man. I mean, we, like I said, we we can trust somebody, but of course, you know, life can happen. Yeah. You know, next thing you know, like your vehicle that you used to, you know, go to work, go to school. Now you're dealing with this. Now you're dealing with that. That's great. And it sucks, man. You know, like he had a very interesting story because literally all day, um... You know, people are like, oh, yeah, give me the hundred bucks. I'm going to just throw the cake. And I'm like, oh, okay. Really? And then I, I heard what you were saying that like, you know, like how, like, how are you raised and this and that. And so. It's really about the how, morals. I mean. Mm-hmm. Like, like, where do you come from? Like, what background? Like, were you, you know, raised like in a religious family or, you know, moral family? Yeah, I was raised in a really like Catholic, um, Hispanic household, if you believe it or not. Um, mm-hmm. The minority here in uh, most in the area, I mean, uh, it's really hard for us, I mean, to like, just go about like life, really, like finding a job, it's, it's really difficult, I mean, like. That's because you're a freshman as well. Yeah, like, I mean, uh, What are you studying for? I want to go into engineering, I want to do something. Oh, nice. Uh, yeah, I want to do something good. I want to help uh, build the community, I mean. Nice. Yeah. Thank you. See, that's pretty cool. I mean, going into like engineering and then, you know, there, once you go into engineering, there's a lot of possibilities, like a lot of doors are going to open for you. Yeah. And that's actually really cool. Oh, thank you. I mean, my goal is really to like help out my family. I mean, they did so much for me. I just want to help out. I mean, mm-hmm. I want to hopefully my goal is to retire my dad. like. I just want him to get out of the work, uh, his workplace, and just come home like full time. And um, like, where does he work or what? Uh, out of state. Uh, oh, right out of state. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Right now he's at Oklahoma. Uh, we hardly see him, and just just want to see him more often. You know. Mhm. And so you live with both of your parents, but your dad's working uh, up north, right? My mom. Uh, she passed away a couple years ago, and. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Yeah, it's just. I, I didn't mean to, you know, it's, it's okay. bring up I mean, any memories or anything. It's really been hard, tough on my dad, really. It's just been me and him. Mm-hmm. Um, he's supported me, uh, like, through uh, through her death. Um, I was only eight at the time, and I mean, it's been hard on both of us. I mean, I just want to hopefully. Like do something positive for him, uh, since all he's done is support me. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah, I mean, losing a parent is you know, especially at that age, you know, where you're so young, and then, you know, unfortunately for your mom to pass, it's it's a struggle, and it's it's gonna hurt you. And yeah, I mean, just hearing like your story all day, like, it's really uh, motivating and very. You know, like it. I, I feel you. You know, I, I can connect with you. So I know you were telling me about cars, and what if I told you that I actually have a um, a limited edition to scale um, vehicle for you? Like a um, replica? Or? Yeah, it's a full size replica. 
um, that I have as a collection. Um, my vehicle is actually right just around here, the corner. If you know, if you want to come and check it out with me, because um, like I said, I I can tell your your dad's a car person, so yeah. I'm like, well, you know, I actually have a replica vehicle, like to full size. Mm -hmm. And um, do you do you want to check it out with me? Oh uh, sure. Oh uh, yeah, let's go take a look at it. All right, cool. And then let's go. Perhaps the rain is probably gonna calm down. I mean, it's starting to rain again, but eh, I think it'll pass. But um, yeah, let, let's just take a quick walk before it, it, you know, comes real heavy. Cool. Yeah, let's go. All right, come on. You know, like I heard your story, and you know, I was so motivated. But remember that toy car that I was gonna give you as well? Yeah. All right, so it's actually over here. It's actually in, a, in my vehicle. All right. Is in the uh, in the back? Yeah. All right. Here, come check it out. Um, but also, before of anything, actually, the the truck that I'm gonna give you mm -hmm. is actually this one. What do you mean? Yeah, like this is actually your vehicle. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, Are you messing with me? No, no, no. I'm not messing with you. This is actually what I do for a living. Bro, this is like. I can't take this. Okay. Yeah, you can. Here, trust me. There's no catch. This is actually all yours. For real, it's it's all yours. I spoke to my team. Um, this is what I do for a living. I do these social experiments, and you know, for the people that have a very good story and a very, you know, touching story, I um, I give this. So I heard your story. You know, I completely felt with you, and you know, I wanted. To, I spoke to my team, and I wanted to get you this. I mean, just can you? Can you yeah, yeah. This? I got you. This is insane. Yeah, that's for you. Test it out. Yeah, go Are for you it. sure? Yeah, yeah. Go for it. Mm. You're gonna love it. It's this a 2024 is very hard to King Ranch. Wow. Are you sure? Yep. Brand new. 2024. That's insane. So now you can actually, you know, use it as an Uber or you know, go out and help your. Nah, dad. it's because. <laughs> I've been really needing a new vehicle, like, I'm heading to college soon, and... Can I give you a hug? Of I'm course, like, of course, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Like, of course, man. I really appreciate it. Literally, you know. Do you wanna... Yeah. I, don't, I don't know how this works, can you hop yeah, on so and like... Here, so hop on, Okay. and then press the brake, and then the button. So you press the brake, uh huh, and then press the button. Look how wow. beautiful that sounds. <laughs> Look how beautiful that sounds. And now you got a new right for college as well. I don't know what to tell you. Trust me, you don't have to tell me anything. It's all completely yours. You deserve it. And it's yours. Like, thank you. I'm like, this is insane. This is by far the most amazing thing that's ever happened to me in my life and I don't know how to thank you enough. <laughs> yeah man, trust me, like I said, this is what I do for a living and you know, you have a big heart and I think you deserve this. So, you know, welcome aboard your, your new vehicle. Don't forget your dad's cake. Yeah, don't forget your dad's cake when you come back. <laughs> thank you very much. Yeah, man, have fun. I really mean it, bro. Like, thank you very yeah, much. Yeah, go for it, bro. Have fun. It's all yours. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. Um... Take care, brother. Take care, bro. I'll see you at the office. All right.